117-45 for Army. 118-46 for BU as we go into the final turn here in the women's 200 medley. Navy's Maya Novak looking to set the tone for the mids and Navy takes home the first gold medal here in championship week. Crowd to its feet. Navy looking to hold on to close out night number one. And they will. 6-23-56 for gold. Baldwin starting to push ahead. The mids looking for a gold. Meade looking to defend the final push. And it will be Navy's Gabby Baldwin for the victory. Winning time of 159.18. Uh, NCAA B cut time. Owen Harlow might have a slight lead, but look at the bottom of your screen. Just ahead in lane number five, it will be, in fact, Jonah Harm. 19.49, and on cue, he sets a new record across the board. The freshman Gelbach has in store after winning the prelims earlier today. And you see the reaction from the mids on the pool deck. Have another look. 72 points for that dive for the freshman Gelbach. The mids looking to return on top. Weber trying for an extra push. Down to the wire we go, and it's Navy winning gold as Maya Novak holds on for the mids. Navy looking to win its fourth straight. Down the stretch, the finish, and it is Navy by a hair. A tenth of a second, and the victory goes to the mids. Off the block wall, 24-92 in lane six. It's Caroline Irwin of Navy. Navy, 200 of a second quicker than the defending champion, Watts. Off the final turn, Irwin giving Watts everything she can handle. Lane three is Megan Cole as well for Army. This is going to be close. Watts, Irwin to the wall, and it's going to be Navy's Caroline Irwin taking down Watts. Twenty eighty-eight, though, for the favorite Jonah Harm. Harm hustling his way to the final turn. The senior looking to put an exclamation point on this event in his career, and he'll do just that with a three-peat. 45-78, the winning time. Loyola's Mead last year, but now has to deal with the newcomer, Ella Habyan of Navy, who emerges out of the water with the white cap and the lead. The first year, looking for a gold medal for Navy, and she will get it with a time of 53-41. Strong performance, and in lane at number five, it is Ben Irwin, the number one seed time at 22-27, leading the way. 22-62 at the bottom of your screen from Alex Edwards of Army. Irwin looked like he got shot out of a cannon off that turn, and for the goal, it will be Irwin. 
Navy starting to put on a show here tonight. Irwin has three medals on the week in his first championship. Make it number four. One forty-one oh six for the first year. Trailing one of Navy's best in Jonah Harm. Let's see if Kelly can come from behind to defend. Down the home stretch. Winning gold, it is Jonah Harm of Navy. The man cannot be stopped. 43-47, Harm picks up his sixth medal of the week. Riley Groves of Army, even just about with Colwell for the fight for silver. Irwin with a near body length lead. Looking for another medal this week. Irwin to the wall for the gold. One forty-three ninety-three. An inward three and a half somersault tuck. Degree of difficulty three point four. Gelbach quickly out of the water. And that closes out our men's three meter championship diving event. And unofficially, that will give Gelbach the gold medal at 392.2. And the mids sweep the top three spots. George Moore will take home silver at 368.8, trying to make ground up as well. The Navy mids are your 2024 champions in the 400 free. A winning time of 2.52.50 and it shatters the pool, league, and meet records. Trying to get one more good photo. And Navy. We'll celebrate. Once again, congratulations to Bill Roberts and his entire coaching staff on another impressive season and another championship.